Okay, so here we are. Here we are. Our super duper best friend, Adam, has asked us to make some cheesy potato concoction. There we go. It doesn't look like potatoes. It looks like marshmallow fluff. And they got like a big paddle. This is like table side guacamole. They're like cheese wizards. You know in the Olympics when they have the streamer competition? What's that called? Rhythmic gymnastics. I don't, I'm not a big Olympics guy. What kind of cheese do we need? Let's look it up. T-O-M-M-E. Tom. Tom means cheese. Tom means cheese. So no. you can't just say we need Fromage cheese. Fromage is also cheese. I think Tom is a type of cheese. It's a type of cheese. Is a class of cheese produced mainly in the French Alps and in Switzerland. Do we just call places? I hate talking to people on the phone. I'll do the talking. I, I want to check if you have a particular kind of cheese. I think it's called Tom de Auvergne or something like that. Auvergne. Okay, thank you. So we have none of the things to make this. No. So we need cheese, potatoes, butter, heavy cream. Oh, and we need a pot and a paddle. Big but kitchen. We can paddle. try. Okay. I, I'm I'm looking for like like a large flat wooden spoon, almost like a paddle, but not quite that large. We're looking for a wood paddle, a nice big one. <laughs> Let's go! Yay. <laughs> Got it. Tom Dovern. I don't know, how much cheese is this? Uh, it's about four pounds. Costs us like 150 bucks. But it is the right kind. We got the bottles and we got there you the go. cheese. Whoop. Whoop paddle. Okay, and we also got this cheese. This is the Tom Dover. Okay, and so the first thing that we have to do is boil these potatoes. Yeah, how do you want to do this? We're going to peel these. That We didn't get a peeler. Am I yeah, allowed to go this way? Get, get two peelers. <laughs> Can I go this way? There is nothing appealing about this scenario. I think we should just double I, the recipe no. right now. Yes. No, that's a bad idea. No, it's not. Fine, but if it doesn't work and it's disgusting and we're out of potatoes, it's your fault. I'm okay with that. Aprons. Is apron a French word? How does this work? Oh, I see. Okay, so what we also need to do is to quarter these potatoes. And oh! I just asked Adam why he cast you and I together. And? His answer was, we're both interested in cooking, but inexplicably bad at it. Potatoes coming in. Teamwork. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna start heating it up. Oh, you're taking so long to do that. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Garlic is so messy. Bloop. So how do we do this? Should we start with a little... I'll Unwrap just like... it first. Ooh, it's pretty stinky. And they just show up smelling like oh that, my and God, you're like... smell that. <gasps> we don't really know much about this cheese, do we? Uh, it smells like a bunny's cage. <laughs> <laughs> it's like that combination of grassy pellet food and poops. Pea soaked hay. Yeah, soiled <laughs> newspaper. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it hit you now. So this is so stinky we had to get somebody else to smell it. So like from here. <laughs> Can you start to smell it yeah. already? <laughs> Come take a whiff. Oh my god. <laughs> it's like something I've never smelled before. It doesn't taste like the smell. Thank goodness for that. <laughs> All right, so the potatoes are done. They are soft, and we're gonna put them through this food mill. Wow, this is gonna be a lot of work. Whoa. Here, let me try some. So Adam thinks we're gonna mess up and says that we should reserve some of each of the ingredients, so we're gonna go with that. That's kind of what I said at the beginning. Mm, Adam put it more concisely. Ridiculous. Do you want to hold it and then I'll stir? Yeah, that's a good okay. idea. It smells really good. <laughs> there yeah. it is. <laughs> that's it. See, it would have been easier if we started out with less. Sorry. <laughs> How's it looking? Well, it's not like. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is what it should look like. I think we got a long ways to go. Theirs is a perfectly smooth texture. Yeah, that's why ours needs to melt more. We're on the right track, you just gotta keep mixing. Or not. Okay, what if we downsize? Okay, so we have in a smaller portion, we're gonna try a different ratio of cheese. Because maybe, I think we maybe had too many potatoes. 
I wonder whose fault that is. I think we're gonna need more than two pounds of potato. I think we should just double I, the recipe. No, recipe. <laughs> almost. Yeah. Keep going, keep stirring. It's gotta heat up. Look, you can barely get it to here. That guy in the video was like up to here. Almost. Okay, so that didn't really work out. We got close with the texture, but it's nowhere near the consistency from the video. I did a little bit more research and I found a few recipes where they puree the potatoes in the food processor with the butter and the cream. That already gives it a better starting texture. It's like potato milk. I didn't know that you could whip potatoes like this and this is what would happen. Do you want the, the big spatula? <laughs> it's hard to pick it up. So, I think Andrew's in a bit of a blind fury. Adam tried working on my revised version, which is okay, but not quite. Tastes ridiculous. Yeah. Wanna go away? It's good though, mm -hmm. right? It's, it's good cheese. It tastes like, it tastes expensive. You used everything on the first try. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> this is just baby food. It looks so easy, the ingredient list is so easy, but man, the technique was just not. Can we go home now? <laughs> you gotta go serve this to people. Who's gonna eat this? Oh, God. No. Wow. It's good. Oh, shut up. Oh. It's a lot. <laughs> this is a just lot. Just go, one, two, three. I don't love it. <laughs> I don't love it. It's kind of like old cheesy, which, yeah, I'm a little offended. Okay, I like the cheese. Into it? I'm into it. I'm pretty good. Right? I'm pretty good. Ew, I don't like What? What a success. Oh my god, people are impressed. I mean, a lot of people had a lot of fun eating this. <laughs> really, it's in quality of service more than the consistency of the cheesy potato. I think it just puts a smile on people's faces. Okay, that we can agree on that. Oh, yeah.